Hi, my name is Bonnie McCann, and my Flow Hive is here in Makakilo in Hawaii. I was given a swarm last year in August, and here we are one year later. When we first moved to this house, I really wanted to make it a haven for, for bees and butterflies, and planted a lot of things, flowering fruit trees and flowers in addition to vegetables, just to add a safe home for the bees. And then about a year after we had moved in, I started to see honeybees arrive. I got more and more curious about beekeeping. Right about that time, a lot of people came into my life who did bees and started talking about bees. I thought, well, maybe I'll just have a hive, not for the honey, but as a home for the bees. If it wasn't primary, I want honey. You know, I really wanted to have something good for the bees. And then I saw the videos that came out for Flow Hive. That really started me thinking that I think I could do this on my own. So I started talking about it to somebody who has been doing it for about five years. So he said, I'm gonna do a harvest. I have a deep box that is full to the brim. Um, be great if you could help me. I said, great, this is what I need. I wanna see what a harvest is like. A few hours later, very hot, sticky, I came home, I called my husband, we're getting the flow hive. <laughs> we are getting the flow hive. I said, that was a lot of work. It was hot. It was, it, I, I couldn't imagine doing it by myself. And, and that was it. I said, I'm, I'm gonna do the flow hive. So May 19th was when I put the flow hive on. And today is August 8th. And um, they're definitely in there. They're doing some capping, they're putting in a lot of honey. The advice that I give a new beekeeper or someone who's considering bees is the more you learn about them and interact with them, the more joy you'll receive from them. Bees are also easier than, than you think, you know, and they are easier than a dog. You can go on vacation for a week and, and not, not worry about them. It's just, it's another anchor to bring me outside and make me slow down and look at things and care for things. And weeding the garden is so much more pleasant when you can sit there and smell, smell the honey. You know, you don't realize I'm not the hardest worker in this garden. How cool was that? We've got lots of sweet stories coming up each week. So if you want to be up to date, hit the subscribe button below.